Alright, welcome back to Pokemon Emerald Randomizer. So let's finish up this cave. More Slakoffs? Jeez, there's a bunch of them here. Um, Rolling Kick and a uh, Place Kick. There you go. Double Team, shit. Well, good thing I got Aerial Ace, but I can Meteor Mash this one. Almost take it out. Rolling Kick and Aerial Ace to make sure. Uh, Rolling Kick, Aerial Ace. Uh, overheat Air uh, Blaze Kick. Magic Coat doesn't really help. Not when you're having attack moves against you. It would help if something like Leech Seed. Okay. Little puzzle here, but it's middle, left, right. Right. Middle, left, right. And then left, right, left. Okay. Item here. Big mushroom. Yay, more shrooms. Now, we got a fight here. Do I have to heal? I kinda do. Do I have any heal items? I have some energy roots, but that's a bit excessive. Do I have any berries? Yeah, I got some orange berries. That'll just heal a little bit. Just heal up Growlithe. Wait, no, orange berry. And another orange berry for you. And then one citrus berry goes to Galfram. Well, that should be it. Time to fight Archie! Hello! The big man Archie, you see that? Overheat. X attack. Not gonna help, not gonna help. Megadium. Uh, Ra! We should do the honors of Blaze kicking this lovely Megadium. And aerial edge to make sure, because basically can miss. Yawn. Ah! Nice. Unknown. Well, I got astonished now. Might as well. Wow, that was easy. Foo foo foo! A lot of people say foo 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 in this game, not sure why. And. Kyoko woke up. Problem, big rain, oh no. Yes. This is bad. I know. You're both idiots. And Stephen comes along and states the obvious, and now we're gonna go down here and grab an item. Black Belt. Meh. Okay. Go to Sutopolis City, watch a little cutscene there. Uh, okay. No Goldeen. I said no Goldeen, we can't play today. Oh, actually, I think there's a trainer in front of this city. Yes, there is. I forgot about you. Sleep powder. Uh, no. Yes. No sleep powder, please. Not on wheel, Lord. Okay, Galthron, now we need to dive here. Go in. And watch a little small cutscene. I always thought that Groudon would be so screwed in a fight like, like this. It's a ground Pokemon on a little island surrounded by water against a legendary water Pokemon. How much chance would it have, actually? I guess none. But yeah. I still think Groudon is the cooler looking one, though, compared to Kyogre. I like Groudon more, but he would lose that fight all the time. Um, now I need to pick up my fly Pokemon because I need to do a lot of climbing and afterwards I want to go back. I don't want to walk back. Okay. Um, yes. So, let's go do this real quick. We need to go to Pacific Clock City and then go to the right and there should be Sky Pillar now. Wait, did I fight you guys? No, I didn't think so. Um, Thunderbolt and Blaze Kick. Ralph is a pretty good moveset right now, actually. Just Rock Throw could be better. 
But once he becomes an Arcanine, that's a pre pretty fierce moveset. Okay, go to the right, go to the right, go to the right. Then you go up here and through the rocks, or rather, not through the rocks, around the rocks. You know what I mean. And there's Sky Pillar. Now, the first time you... I forgot the event in Sutopolis, didn't I? God damn it! I knew I forgot something. Because I need to speak with Steven here first and then go see Wallace in the cave. Yeah, shit. My bad. Blah, blah, blah. Take me to the cave. Blah, blah, blah. Take me to the cave. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Now we go see Wallace and then we go to Skyfair. I was a bit too eager. Hi, Wallace. What's up? Do you perhaps know where Marquasa is now? Sky Pillar. The other two are kind of... Well... That's a freaky Torchic! It looks dead! It's a zombie Torchic! Ugh! Run away! Please. Okay, let's do this again. This time, we will succeed. So, a simple Lock City. Go right. Get attacked by random enemies. Bulbasaur, always good on the water, yes. Now go in here. And then, this time, we got a Wallace cutscene. Yeah, that's right. He will open the door. Now, the first time you go in here, it's all clean, at least in the Emerald version. But the second time, and that's after the Elite, the Elite Four, there's actually a lot of rubble here, and you have to use the Mach Bike to get all the way to the top and fight Rayquaza. Now, I don't remember how you fight Kyogre and Groudon in Emerald. Have to look it up. But I was thinking that maybe we should do the three Regis and uh, Kyogre, Groudon, and Rayquaza in this game as a bonus after Elite Four, because I think those are randomized as well. That'd be pretty funny if it was like a Pidgey or something instead of a Rayquaza. At the very least, they'll, they'll be fun challenges to beat, so... Yeah, more or less optional bosses. We'll do that later after the game is over. So first of all... Hi! And he left off. Now we're going to fly back to Sutopolis City and we're going to see uh, what I think is the funniest cutscene in this entire game. Only in Emerald. Whoops, I got a phone call. Dang it! I'll be right back. Yeah? Sorry about that. I mean, sorry about that. What a time to get a phone call, damn it. Anyway, this is, I think, the funniest cutscene in the game. To me, Rayquaza always... I mean, I had the comparison of Rayquaza and a nanny. Like, break it up, kids, break it up! And then, yeah, they sort of do. Stop fighting! Because he literally just pushes them apart. I'm not sure where Groundon goes, actually. But just go with it. I think it's pretty funny. And now all's well. Yay. Do we need... No, we don't need fly. We need to do the 8th gym. So Espion, please, come back. We may need your awesome powers. Okay, actually, I don't need you. Just go in a corner. I don't need you anymore. Actually, well, I do, because we need to do the uh, trick house after this, uh, after this gym. So, I need these. Okay. Um, level 44, that's fine. Okay. Talk to them. Ah, we did a bad thing. Talk to him. Ah, we are so wrong. Bye. And now we get the Waterfall HM. Which we can't use until we defeat the gym leader. 
So that's what we're gonna do now. However, there's a bunch of trainers in here, and you can actually miss every single trainer if you mess up all. I mean, if you mess up, if you get all the puzzles right in one go, then fight the gym leader. And after you beat the gym leader, all the trainers will be docile. So don't do that. Instead, I think you have to go in this spot. Ah, I need to go one to the left because this is the only one you can't do a double fight on. Ah oh, well, Barboach. Uh, pedal dance. Ludicolo. That screams for a lovely poison fang. Or two. How dare you, Asko, spare me. Okay, hello. Dugon. Thunderbolts. Twice. And Ludicolo again. Thunderbolt. Twice. Thrice. Okay. Um. First, we're gonna do this one. Yep, double fight here. Wow, I always, I really like that that Venusaur color scheme. It's pretty nifty. Um, Thunderbolt that, let's kick this. Notice the level on the Pokemon is pretty high here. Energy powder, damn. Level up and just finish it off with place kick again. Rod level 44. Okay. Guard in the front. Now, I think it is this. Yes, another double fight here. Wow. Um. Poison Fang and Frenzy Plant. It's amazing how long I've been using Frenzy Plant. I mean, all the way from level 1 or level 5 or something. Poison Fang and Frenzy Plant again. Oh, you're confused. That's kind of bad. Ah, uh, just Poison Fang. Do the same thing again? Yes, nice. Take care of that. Uh, poison Fang again. Wow. That really hurt. Not a fan. Uh, just French Plant, I guess. Gotta take it out. Blaze Kick. So many Pokemon have Blaze Kick in this game. It's almost unhealthy. Okay. Need to go to the back because you're damaged. Time for Game Pit. Another double fight here. Ralts and Snowrunt. What a team. Iron Tail. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, yeah. Just a slip off. Doesn't really matter. Ralts is so frail. It'll die from most things. And Sludge Bomb, I guess. Um, poison Fang. Iron Tail. Oh, wait. Facade. Iron Tail is low effect for this one. And two more single trainers here. Ah, uh, Brick Break. Fake out. Bah. Don't you bone rush me, you don't even have bones. Well, not like Marowak anyway. Uh, Slow Rock, Tito Dance, Astonish. Pretty strong move actually, with such high attack power. Okay, now we're gonna heal up, and next time we'll do the 8th Gym Leader. I forgot his name, it's not Wallace, that's in the Ruby and Sapphire. Wallace is actually the champion in the Emerald, but... Okay, we'll just do these puzzles correctly. Stop recording, but I should be able to do this in one minute. Yep. All right. Next time, this guy, and then the trick house, and then onward to Victory Road. <laughs>